Yo, what up guys, uh, it's Slade here. Uh, welcome to my first boss and guide video. Today I'll be covering Hellux or Hell Mode Galux, uh, the highest difficulty level for Galux. Um, wanted to start off with this boss to test the waters and see if you guys like these kinds of videos or not. So, yeah. I'm gonna be fighting Hellux with uh, maxed out 5th drop nodes, so <laughs> don't be too surprised uh, when you see my range. I also have a lot of boss damage, and yeah, it's kind of misleading, but I just needed to nerf myself a little bit to uh, make the fight last longer. Alright, so in phase 1, the first thing you want to do is get right to the middle where the portal is, right under Galax's head. Uh, this is probably the safest spot right here, because it allows you to move to the left or right side of Galax's head very easily uh, to dodge his attacks. So you see here, uh, when his eyes light up, I move to the other side very quickly. You just want to always uh, move away from the side that he's facing, so when his eyes light up, you're ready to go. And you won't get hit by his uh, exhale or inhale attacks. Also, as you're doing this, you're also killing the minions that are coming in to the middle. If a minion reaches the middle of the map, uh, where the portal is, it actually adds a curse on your character and it goes up to 5 stacks and at 5 stacks you instantly die and lose one life. And having the curse on you actually will, won't let you um, leave the map by using the portal so you can't leave the map in order to rebuff. Alright so before we move into phase 2 which is the yellow HP bar, you want to make sure all the minions are cleared out before you get them down to the second HP bar. And, uh, okay, here we go. So for phase two, uh, you want to stand to the a little bit to the left of the portal when you go up to the second level platform uh, and attack his eyes right there. And then when you see the big Gollux hand come up on you, you want to use the portal to go down to the bottom plat I mean, the bottom floor, and then kill the minions on both sides of you. His hand attack actually has a delayed uh, hitbox, so it, it won't kill you instantly, so you have time to react to it and use the portal. Or the other thing you can do is duck down to avoid the attack from the hand. Uh, so you just hold your down arrow key and it's really easy, but I like to use this time to take the portal to kill the minions on the bottom uh, and then come back up really quickly. You don't want to stay down there for too long because he could curse you down there and reverse your controls. Or he could nuke you down, uh, with another attack. Which he do will not use if you stand on the second platform. At the eye level he actually has a shout or roar attack that can knock you off the platforms, but if you stand just to the left of the portal you'll be out of range of it and you won't get hit by it. It's the big orange uh, shell thing. So we just need to keep doing this until we get him down to the last HP bar, which is the green one. Uh, some things to note are that you should save your burst or uh, high damage cooldowns for this last phase because it's a it's a damage race. It's a race against the timer. So I kind of messed up here because I should have used my uh, all my important buffs before starting this phase. So I kind of lost a bit of time here, but it's okay because I'm OP. So. <laughs> uh, the minions continue to spawn in this phase, so you got to go down and kill them uh, every like 10 seconds or so. And then get back up really quickly, which is not a problem for us. Just use Vapor Blade and Falcon Dive. And that's it for phase three. There's nothing much else to explain. It's you just go, you just want to kill the gem as fast as possible before you run out of time. Uh, you can see the timer with the red bar. All right, so that's my first boss and guide video. Um, for anyone who made it this far and watched the whole thing so far, you're awesome and stay awesome. <laughs> Uh, the next video, I'll, I mean the next boss I'll be covering will be Lotus, so stay tuned for that. 
uh, if anyone's interested. And if you have any suggestions on how I could improve my guides, uh, go ahead and leave a comment. Uh, thanks again for watching, guys. Um, if you want to see more Hayato videos, please subscribe. If you like this video, please leave a comment or like. And uh, that's it. Have a good day, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.